Let's complete an activity together. Click on the name of an activity to open it. Read the directions and answer the questions. If you need to answer any fill in the blank or free response questions, most courses will include a special characters palette. and it will be entered in the box. Answer all the questions and the program will grade it for you. Make sure you click Finish Submit for Grading. Click Finish. Since this was a machine graded activity, you'll see your score and also a summary of what you got correct and incorrect. We want to help you get a better grade in the class. When you get something wrong, we'll give you a hint. Click on the bubble that appears next to the wrong answer. You'll see a specific hint to help guide you with that question. These hints are specific to the answer of the question. Want to try again? Well, click Try Again. You're then able to try the activity again. Notice your answers are saved when you try again. You will still have your feedback bubbles, but guess what? We didn't stop there. We wanted to give you additional help as well. In the upper right hand corner, you may see a button that says, Need help with this activity? Put your mouse on it and you will have additional access to specific help about the topic you're learning. The exact e-text page where you need to study is brought right to you and will open up in a new window to help you with your homework. In addition, you may see grammar tutorials or vocabulary tutorials or even a flashcard link or extra practice activities that will help you with this exact assignment. You can change your answers and then resubmit for grading. Each time you submit an activity, that submission is saved in the system. And by default, your highest grade is recorded in the gradebook. When you return back to your course, notice you will have a View Submissions button appear. This will appear after you complete an activity and it will give you quick access to review any of your previous submissions. If you still have additional attempts left on the activity, you can open the activity again to complete it from scratch while your original grades are always saved and recorded in the gradebook. And you can always review your work by clicking on the View Submissions button.